Diana Eck, Professor of Comparative Religion and Indian Studies, and also a Harvard College professor. But what I'd like to say about diversity and the change is that Harvard College is just not the same college it was in the 1970s or the 1980s. When I started teaching as a teaching fellow, it was a college in which most of the houses were still same-sex houses uh, and in which the diversity of the student body wasn't anywhere near what it is today. I think one of the things that is another big change over the years that I've been here is the whole issue of gays and lesbians and diversity in our community. Because this was not, when I started teaching, this was not something that was uh, sort of widely, overtly part of Harvard's culture. And gradually there are lots more uh, people on faculty and staff who are uh, gays and lesbians. And that's a good thing. And it is something that's more visible all the time. When Dorothy and I were made housemasters, that was uh, 18, no, 15 years ago, in 1998, this was a, a very new thing to have housemasters, a same-sex couple. And I would say that if you were to ask what impression does this make on students, uh, to some extent this is the sea that students swim in. They're, they're, uh, they're very easy with this but it makes a big difference to their parents and their extended families who come here to our residence on Junior Parents Weekend and on commencement, and we greet them and op you know, uh, with open arms and see them with their, their offspring at some celebratory time, and they're in our house and in our backyard, and uh, you know, a, a real sense of sort of the normalization of this at in the Harvard context. And for many people who come here from other parts of the United States or other parts of the world, um, this is eye-opening. Uh, I mean, we don't uh, go around, I certainly don't, you know, go around thinking all day long that, uh, you know, I'm a gay woman. It's just not, I mean, it's part of my assimilated personality as it is for uh, for most of our faculty and staff and others at Harvard, um, but I think uh, the fact that that this has become something that is simply part of life is uh, is something that students, especially students who come from families or parts of the country where this is hard for them, um, and if they're gay themselves and they're coming out and they're from a small town in Texas or something. This matters. This aspect of Harvard's diversity and our acceptance of, uh, of the spectrum of human diversity is really important. This is a new phase of my own uh, sort of awareness of our human diversity. And I think to have created a community where it's not only all right to be who we are, but that the engagement with difference is really a strengthening thing. It makes us better people.